a lot of times are teenage girls. They can come in with urinary leakage, like especially when they're doing any sort of athletics, like dance or gymnastics or running or pole vaulting, um, any type of athletic event that causes a lot of changes in our intra-abdominal pressure, which is good and healthy, but they can demonstrate or show our weakness in our pelvic floor. And so sometimes teenagers can have urinary leakage. And so we see that and we also see pelvic pain. So this is, you know, surrounding the age of menarche and girls and teens are starting to use tampons. And so those can often cause pain if there is pelvic floor dysfunction. And so as a physical therapist, our responsibility is to make sure that these muscles are working correctly, that they're relaxed and that the patient has control over their muscles. Because a lot of times we just don't even know that we can control these muscles or that we have any, you know, volition over them. And so it's really helpful to educate them so that they know that they can control and relax their muscles so that there's no pain because pain is not normal in this area. And so that's really helpful and can give a lot of freedom. 